Hi guys, it's Saturday morning, September 21st. This is my diabetes walk for blood sugar control, guys. Everything's been really good. You know, I consistency breathes consistent results, guys. Blood sugar is fine. Endurance is great. Talked to my um, doctor on teleconference yesterday. Had a great telehealth um, appointment. And um, my labs were spectacular. They even tried to convince me to change course in my health plan that I de designed for myself. That's working excellent. So why should I change course? Because it's become a lifestyle, guys. So I'm gonna continue my healthy lifestyle because why it's producing positive results guys i will not go backwards because i do not want any negative results when everything is proof positive guys so continuing with my vegan keto, 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 keto diet Continuing walking in the mornings and the evenings, my podiat my podiatrist is impressed because he used to have a um, hold on walking for exercise. My gastro gastroenterologist is impressed because he, at one time he wanted to put a pacemaker on my stomach because my stomach wasn't working. He said, "Whatever you're doing, Mr. Rogers, continue." My endocrinologist is impressed because he says he can't believe the results. He says, continue what you're doing. My neurologist is impressed. He says, continue what you're doing. My, my primary care is saying, oh, maybe you don't have to do anything any longer. No, 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 no. That's why I built such great relationships with the specialists who are actually more trained in the Pacific areas that's, that, um, that's affected me so much. But everything is really well, you know. When I was on a, um, such a bad slide into so many complications and associated illnesses, I took upon myself to do further research because I didn't want to go down that negative path because it only left, it, it would only lead to one direction. And, and that would be, uh, so that's when I discovered the keto, keto diet, intermittent fasting, you know, insulin resistance and how to avoid it. And so everything turned around from there. I hope that helps everyone listening, you know, who's, who, who can't seem to find their ground and, and positive diabetic health, you know, and that's the point guys, that's the point. So this is, oh my God, it's so hot today. But you know, we gotta do what we have to do. We gotta walk, we gotta move. It's so much research is coming out about just simple walking and how it can positively affect your health. We know it can help prevent, them at least three times a week, help prevent certain types of cancer because cancer can, certain types of cancer or metabolic diseases. I mean, walk, walking is such a positive tool in your diabetic toolbox. So guys, if you're diabetic, walk, walk, walk. Guys, I, I, I like to announce, I like to make, the, uh, make an announcement. I started um, with, the, with the, um, the arm, the arm rates. I started, I, I did the, what do you call those, um, dumbbars. So I'm starting with my resistance training because um, I watch several, I've been following several um, doctors who are saying once you over 40, the outcomes of certain complications, muscle, the loss of muscle mass is indicative to a lot of negative outcomes or complications that you have once you pass, once you get into after 40. So you, we have to reverse 
muscle loss to improve our outcomes. So guys, definitely we got to um, um, work on um, increasing our muscle mass as we um, as we um, advance in age, as di especially as diabetics, because we lose muscle mass at a higher rate, guys. We got to get on board, get on board. So first I wanted to increase my endurance, then increase my um, muscle mass. Where my diabetics at, guys? You gotta get on board, comment, comment. If you're diabetic, comment below. It's a hot day in South Florida, you wouldn't believe it. This early already. I think they said it's gonna be near record. It seemed like summer n never ends in South Florida any longer. And another positive thing about the walking is that walking helps um, your, your mitochondria and your, 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 through your, your, your metabolism. The more you, early morning walking carries, up, carries throughout the day, increased metabolism, car, uh, you, you burn your carbs at a greater rate throughout the day. So guys, just, just a quick live. I'm gonna con concentrate on the rest of the walk, but I just wanted to touch base with you guys and let you know I'm still walking and I want and, and to encourage other diabetics to continue the fight, continue the cause, guys. We have to keep up a good fight, guys. We can't lay down.